Emeritus Senior Minister Go Chok Tong says it's important for Singaporeans to reflect on the values and contributions of the generation that built Singapore. Mr Go spoke to the media after paying his respects to former Deputy Prime Minister and founding chairman of the People's Action Party, Dr To Chin Chai. Mr Go says it is crucial for future generations to build on the edifice created by the old guard leaders and secure a better future for Singapore. He also says Dr To never campaigned against the PAP despite his disagreements with then Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew over several government policies. He was critical of policies, maybe of uh, sometimes uh, policy of self-renewal, but plus other policies as well, but never actively, you know, uh, went out to campaign against the party. Whatever he said, even though they were political comments, were actually meant from his point of view for the good of the country and the party. So I regarded uh, that kind of uh, personality as uh, on a very uh, valuable uh, contributions uh, for younger people like myself. So we learned a lot from him and those are the values we hope we can impart to uh, others as we ourselves take a back seat. Members of Parliament who attended Dr To's wake said more should be done to preserve his legacy so that young Singaporeans can better understand his contributions to nation building. Residents and grassroots leaders from the former Rojo district where Dr To Chin Chai served as MP for 29 years came in droves to pay their last respects. We all remember him as a person who, have left, uh, who has left a legacy in our district. Even today, we have a benevolent fund for the poor and needy that is uh, dedicated to him. For others, Dr To's critical views on government policies when he became a backbencher left a strong imprint on their minds. One that I could remember quite well was his argument against uh, uh, evicting uh, families who had, uh, whose family member had, had been convicted for um, uh, throwing litter, killer litter. Dr. To thought that uh, we should not punish all other family members because one person had done the damage. He always had a very uh, crit critical way of looking at issues and uh, he never hesitated to put his view across. Right. Um, however unwelcome the views were, he was prepared to speak out, which is important. You know. So. His views, I'm sure, helped to shape policies, although he was a backbencher. His courage of conviction, his fearless attitude, and I think his, his ability to stand up even to uh, ex-Prime Minister Mr Lee Kuan Yew is well documented. And I think that's something we should learn from. He is not afraid to stand up for what he believes is right. And I think that's something that is sorely needed in today's uh, uh, society. However, some are worried that the younger generation may not be aware of Dr To's contributions. What is sad to me really is that um, many of the young people I spoke to don't know much about uh, late Dr. To Chin Chai. So I really hope that we can do something to, so that our young will know him better as a person, his battles, his fights, in order to gain independence for Singapore. Tomorrow is the final day the public can pay respects to Dr. To at his Greenview Crescent home.